a BJT transistor has maximum power dissipation of 4 watt at an ambient temperature of 30 degrees centigrade. Okay, power dissipation of 4 watt, ambient temperature 30 degrees centigrade, and a maximum junction temperature of 150 degrees centigrade. Device is operating with an ambient temperature of 30 degrees centigrade and is dissipating 1.5 watt. Okay, the junction temperature of the device is, so we have to calculate the junction temperature of the device. Now, those of you who are not aware of what junction temperature of the device means, it's basically the highest operating temperature of the actual semiconductor the electronic device is made of. So, very simple, we have a calculator, uh, we have a formula here, uh, TJ, actually before we move on to the formula, let's look at some of the acronyms here. So, T of J is basically the junction temperature. Remember, this is what we are striving for. We need to find out that. Then we have the thermal resistance, uh, basically from junction to atmosphere. Uh, we have the ambient temperature, Ta, and then P is basically the power dissipation. And to calculate the jun junction temperature, here is the formula, right? Now, there's one parameter which is actually missing, which is right here. So we're going to find out that first. And the formula to calculate that is right here. It's simply just junction temperature minus Ta over P. Now this Tj is basically the maximum junction temperature which is already given in the uh, in the problem. So let's try to plug in these values. So junction temperature maximum is 150 degrees centigrade. The ambient temperature is 30 degrees centigrade. Uh, and then we have the power, which is 4 watt here, correct? And if I do the math here, I basically get 150 minus 30 is 120. And 120 degrees centigrade divided by 4 watt. That gives me 30 degrees centigrade per watt. Now I have calculated this. All I need to do is plug in this value in this equation and find out the junction temperature. So let's do that. Tj equals to ambient temperature. That's the uh, temperature at which the device is operating, which is 30 degrees centigrade. So let's put that here. Plus, this is 30 degrees cents per watt, already been calculated. And then in the equation, we have dot power. Power dissipation is 1.5 watt. So 1.5 watt here. Know that watt and watt will basically cancel out. And if I do the math here, 30 degrees centigrade plus 30 degrees centigrade, that makes 30 degrees centigrade plus 45 degrees centigrade. And that sums up 75 degree centigrade and that is your answer that is your junction temperature this is the temperature this is the highest operating temperature of the actual semiconductor in an electronic device um, in operation it is higher than the case temperature and the temperature of the parts exterior just to get you a little bit of more detail